Hey everybody, it's Busy Little Bee. Welcome back to my channel. Yesterday, Yo Mama was talking about Jan's views and her weird ass rationalizations of how Foodie Beauty was not a victim at 16 when she was messing with that 40 year old French man. And Yo Mama called her out on it. And I found myself agreeing with Yo Mama. No matter what you think of Yo Mama or his laugh or, you know, how obnoxious he can be or that wah, 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 air horn, um, he made some damn good points yesterday with Jan. And so much so that she turned around and started attacking his parenting and shit because he made a good point. He played her words excusing this 40-year-old man and kind of blame shifting or or victim blaming to foodie because you know she wasn't a normal 16 year old and as a woman i have a different view of this i guess than your mama so i wanted to share my thoughts but first let me show you what he said and then i'll get to my thoughts at the end your mama's out for himself <laughs> i don't give a fuck about none of this all right i mean i'm not even that old I mean, <laughs> <clears throat> now instead of Jan just taking this up and saying, you know what, I was wrong. This is the wrong. I I made a mistake. No, she doubled down, tripled down, quadrupled down, five time down, 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 down. She keeps on saying that. Well, making excuses. And the other day, it got really bad <clears throat> on her show. Here, wait. Here she is. Here she is on her drama show explaining to everybody her comments about a 16-year-old girl being a different kind of 16-year-old girl and why a 16-year-old girl, it's okay for a young girl to be with a 40-year-old man. Roll it. Which was completely overridden by everybody. And, you know, of course I know it's wrong. Of course I do. Oh. And I wasn't making excuses for him. For God's sake, why would I do that? Is this not you? You know, it, mm -hmm. look, if I was in it, y'all yeah, wouldn't hear a peep from me. Yep. I think Mary, as Mary says here, hi, Mary, nice to see you. But the hey. adult should have known better than to mess with a teen. Of course he should. Of yeah. course he should. But then we don't but what? know what type of adult he was, do we? <laughs> we don't know what kind of adult he was. This is your words. What kind of adult you got to be to mess with a 16-year-old girl at 40? I'm just trying to paint the picture. Uh, we're painting pictures of a 16-year-old girl with a 40-year-old man. This is what we're talking about here? <laughs> Fuck. As perhaps it really was instead of imagining you know this innocent little 16 year old who was like squirreled away into this man's flat that's not what happened she kept going up the stairs to this guy's flat and they kept telling her not to but no 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 it's up to the adult to say no he was yeah. let, letting her in his bed exactly but then i think i could be wrong but i think Shannon said that he was a, he was an alcoholic. I would never ever And here she goes today saying that I would never ever 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 make excuses for a 40-year-old man putting his hands on a on a young girl. That was her today and we just played her 6 months ago 6 months ago and she was making excuses. You know, the way you switched it up from today how not, you never made an excuse for an adult man being with a kid, and but then we played your words. I never said that. I never said that. You just made excuses for him and said he, you could be wrong, but he was no, an alcoholic. I never said that. I never said that. You want me to play it back for do you? you? Wanna, do you want to play it back again? Yeah. Yeah. Let me play it right. Let me play, play it back. Play it. Yeah. Maybe he wasn't coming after her. Maybe he wasn't coming after her. I know you have comprehensive. Uh, problem. I'm playing your so you're, okay. Okay, you're, you're <laughs> cognitively right. Inept. Cognitively right. But what amazes me is how you have the gall to sit there laughing about something that isn't funny at all. 
you sit there laughing like a hy hyena about something that isn't funny at all. I'm playing and your you words. You have the nerve to speak about me like that? Because you're disgusting. You. Okay, just act like a 40-year-old man. Okay, I'll try. What I was trying to do was speak as somebody who has worked with teenage girls and I was trying to explain that there are many kinds of 16 year old girls. There are some girls who because of their upbringing or uh, because of their circumstances will act differently to other 16 year old girls. It's common sense. Now, I know that that's something that you lack, but I do take offense to you keep going on and on, as do other people who obviously have the same mindset as you. For you, for you to look at teenagers and to place them in different categories, be judging oh them God. based on where they came from and what their upbringing is because they weren't innocent like the kids that you pro possibly raised is disgusting. A child is a child. And if you can't see that, you're just a disgusting human. And, and at the end of the day, for you to make excuses for a 40 year old man like you've done, you're utter, you don't even get it. And no one can ever speak to you because you'll never change your mind. You can never fucking be wrong. That's your problem. You're too goddamn old. You're too oh old. <laughs> You're too old. You're too old listen, to never listen. be wrong. So like I said, respect. Your mama said what needed to be said. And coming from a female's perspective, of course, I'm going to see things a little bit different. So growing up, of course, I had a lot of female friends and a lot of us were essayed as children by adults. And that can lead to women being promiscuous. However, no matter how promiscuous a 16 year old is, that 40 year old should know better, no matter what, alcoholic or not. I just think it's absolutely ridiculous to let your hate for Chantal lead you to making this horrible public take that she was somehow at fault or this guy was somehow excused because she showed up at his door a few times. You know how easy it is to not answer your door? I do it all the damn time. <laughs> so yes, while there are things that can lead teenage girls to behave in a promiscuous manner, that does not make anything okay about a 40 year old man sexually engaging with her. I don't understand why some of these people cling so hard to these weird ass takes that nobody agrees with. Nobody with common sense agrees with this shit. And I get what your mama is saying also about her age, you know, it happens. When people get older, they tend to get set in their ways, right? I noticed this a lot with my grandparents when I was growing up. They were very set in their ways right around their 60s and they believed what they believed and everything else was false no matter how much proof you had and they did things how they did them and there was no other way to do them and maybe jan's just that but this is a terrible take and it's something bad to put out in the public sphere it's not okay to victim shame it's not okay to ever say anything that the 16 year old in this situation did was wrong that 16 year old could have been told no by the adult in the situation. And that's on that. That's my entire opinion. I hope you guys have a great day. I'll be back with new content soon. Thanks for watching.